I was pruning the apple tree out the back of the house a couple of months ago so hopefully we get some fruit down where we can reach it rather than 15 to 20 feet in the air. I've got one or two decent bits of wood off it so I've uh, cut off a big chunk like this. Um, it's probably a little bit too big for a pen blank but you know, probably a bit small to do too much with. So I thought I'd, uh, I might try and do one of my um, two-piece crochet hooks. Um, I cut it up, I've squared it up with the table saw, uh, and then I've had it sitting now above the, the fireplace for, it's probably been about two or three months now. So hopefully it should be nearly dry. We'll see how it goes. Let you go, pull up 
So that's my, uh, that's how I do the two piece crochet hooks. So the hook in this one's made out of jarrah. Gives me a nice dense timber that will give a nice shiny hook that will uh, not really end up any um, rough bits to catch the wool. And the handle's in apple from my tree at the back. I think that's uh, come up fairly pretty. I'm not much of a crochet myself, so I can't show you how it works, but uh, uh, I'll pass this on to the missus and maybe she can make something. Thanks for watching. Have a good one. Just you make sure, yeah, you're keeping your love and pure. Cause for you know, some cracks make show. And I have to let you go. And I have to let you go. And I have to let you go, go.